All right, so this is a quick little intro. We're gonna get straight into getting some stuff done. Goals for today is get AI working, or Zimwriter, automate Amazon posts, and automate Pinterest. So let's get into it. So like I said previously in other videos, we will be going fast. We will be using tool. You can use uh, Z Zimwriter or use ChatGPT, whatever is gonna be perfect for you. But we're gonna be doing a lot with Zimwriter going forward. I do have a yearly plan and a monthly. Once you subscribe, you're going to use your key to get it set up. So we're gonna install and get it work. You're going to take your key and you're going to use Zimwriter. So start it up, add your info right here, email and your key. So I'm gonna paste this in here and my email. save and verify and then this is where you add in all of your other api keys so grok you can just click on this and tropic api click on this open router click on this use whatever large language model you love and image generator there's so many different ones i'm going to be using chat gpt anthropic um, and probably shawl as the uh, or flax as the image generator there's Dolly, there's a million of them, but I'm gonna show you how to just get a few, but it's really easy to set these up, but I figured I'd uh, spend a little time and show you how to actually get these APIs. So I figured I'd show you really easy, how easy it is to set this up uh, for your API keys. Once this is popped open, you can just literally click this. It'll pop open a window, either sign up or sign in. Once you do that, you'll be brought to API keys right here. All you have to do is create new secret API key call it whatever you want. I like to call it Zim uh, Writer, whatever the actual thing I'm using. Uh, and then I'm gonna copy this and paste this into the API key here, save and verify. And that's really how easy it is. Uh, same thing with the, um, I'm gonna go ahead and delete these because I'm not gonna use them. But uh, same thing with um, the Anthropic or these text ones. All you really have to do is just click on the actual tool. So for instance, let's go to uh, same thing, setting up the API key. We'll go through Anthropic, login, create an API key, Zim1, add, and now we have our key here and we're gonna add it to Anthropic. So really easy to do just like that paste, save, and now we have our API keys. So that's how easy it is. You can do it with text generation. Um, like I said, you'll probably wanna do it with the, uh, with the, uh, where is this one? Set up API images. Uh, I use Fall AI. All you have to do is just go to Fall, sign in, GitHub, get your API key, and then now you have, uh, all the things for images and text so that you can start writing blogs. Now we have to connect WordPress. If you have questions on how to do this, uh, definitely come in our Discord, we'll help you set it up. Uh, there is a support channel, uh, so you can definitely check that out. But once that is set up, let's get into the, the next part. The hotkeys don't matter at this point, you can just save them. And here we are. So we have our license and this is Zimwriter. So we need to connect our few things, WordPress site and a few other things. So let's do that now. All right, so let's connect our WordPress site so we can start cranking out blogs. Uh, obviously we're gonna do a lot of other things, but we need to make sure that they are, the most important thing is actually one clicking a Amazon link and posting to our website. So go to options. We're going to set up WordPress and we're going to take the URL. So if that's brennanduff.com, if that's yourname.com, if that's um, bestproductsonline.com, whatever that is for you, mine's gonna be roofingsupplyco.com. And then the user is going to go down to users on your WordPress site. And right here, this is the user. And I'm gonna go all the way down. So we're gonna copy this username. 
and we're gonna put that into the Zimwriter. And then this password, uh, we need to actually scroll down. So if we go here, this is the password name. So we'll just call this whatever. So this is called uh, Zimwriter. And then we're going to add new password. And this password is right here. So we're going to grab this, paste this in here, boom. And now you do want to make sure that you do have a HTTPS in front of the URL. That's why we have a secure login. And then we're going to save this password. So as you can see, it did save everything. We have our password here. We have a load profile and a load username. So now we are set. We can pull up Zimwriter here and close this out or save options. We need to go to Penny Arcade and boom. We do have our uh, thing now going. We can click on the WordPress. We can click on this, click on the username, click on the category, which we'll worry about later. All right, so we are on the final part before we're able to take bestsellers of Amazon products and upload them to our blog in one click or uh, Halloween decorations in one click just one final step and that is setting up scrape owl to actually grab this information so we need to go to options and go to scrape owl uh, this is five dollars a month i think it is normally i think it's like twenty dollars a month but with zimrider they set up a special plan uh for five dollars which is really inexpensive um, you just sign up here and then put your api key so set new api key all you do is just put it in here i'm going to show you what that looks like once you sign up, all you're gonna do is generate API key, mine's right here, and paste it into the API for Scrape Owl right here. They do give you, I believe, a thousand free credits for a month. All right, so at the moment of truth, we have our Amazon link here, we have Scrape Owl set up, we have our link right here. WordPress is enabled. Later on, we will be doing all of these link packs, style mimics, custom outlines, custom prompts, call to actions, all the fun stuff. But for now, we're just making sure this works. And so right here, we'll just keep all this the same. We have mini, we have the featured image as fluxual like we used to, or like I had previously, every other H2. We're gonna be spending 0 0.0003, so not even a penny, and start Penny Arcade. So if this is correct, then we should have a article going to our, our web, completely new website. So it's scraping the URL right now. It's 50% done. And there is things we can do to customize this to make it even better. But right now we're just getting a rough, we're just getting it done. That way it's completely done and we're able to uh, move on with building it out or hiring someone to build it out or whatever else we need to do. Uh, but this is just a making sure that the whole process is complete from the website being up to having a blog on our article, on our website and it, it's already 90% done. So let's pull up our website here. Go to posts. It's building now our uh, test post here. It's 95, downloading the featured image, generating the image. So it has to create a few more images here in a second. And then it's gonna upload it to the, uh, the good old WordPress site. So let's pull that WordPress site. Uh, well, it's a, it's already uploading right now, so we'll just wait it out. And there we have it. It is finished, one of one, we'll click OK. Refresh this, and two pack Halloween lights preview. Let's check it out. Key takeaways right here, product overview. That's pretty sweet. I mean, that's a pretty cool image. I mean, and this, I mean obviously this is not, roofing and supply doesn't go together. But I just wanted to show you what this looks like. Like right off, like haven't done anything. And this is what we get. We get some decoration ideas. We got a table here. 
customer feedback. Now, those are some cool lights. Uh, conclusion, we'll be taking out some of these like comments and stuff. Uh, we'll probably change the uh, length of the text here so it's more uh, aligned. But it's a good, good first draft, so I like it. Definitely be changing some things, but we have our one-click website already ready to go. And now we need to automate it to Pinterest. So this is what this little magic thing does. If we go to the Pinterest machine, this WordPress, the Halloween thing that I just posted, boom, right here, Pinterest, already has one impression. I literally just posted it and a save, that's insane. Uh, and then it's my website, boom. And then all through here, we'll have affiliate links for these products. So this first product, uh, that second product. So each of these will have affiliate links in them. So if you think about this, we copied and pasted this Amazon product. It created this article for me right here with all the images. It will add pretty soon. It will have the Amazon links all through here just from pasting this article. And then it created the Pinterest, the same images that were um, created on our blog is now on these Pinterest, on these Pinterest boards. And that's going back to that article where people can buy. So I'm, with one click, I have free traffic and up, uh, affiliate links, everything, pretty sweet stuff. So like, how long did that take? Like what? seconds. So you can see how this can get grow really, really quickly. All right, so we set up our website. We have our blog working. Whenever we put in a uh, link, it will automatically upload it to our website. Uh, I showed you that you can set it up with Pinterest. And in the next training, we'll actually walk you step-by-step -step on how to do the Pinterest part. Didn't want to uh, go too long on these videos, make them quick and snappy and keep it to kind of one, uh, one topic. So in the next video, we will be setting up automation for Pinterest.